investment programme that you're going through here uh, in recent times is to, is to add uh, machines that make parts faster, uh, more productivity. Tell us about what's going to be replacing this uh, Haas machine here that you've got. Okay, so we've got a Averex HS450i twin pallet horizontal machine coming in. Um, and again, that is to sort of increase, increase our production levels um, because the demand we're experiencing is you know, so, so significant at the moment. It's, it's a choice we're, we've, we've been wanting to make for a while and obviously now this has given us a good, a good, a good uh, reason to go for it. Now, I think what's important to stress here is this is a, this is a, great, um, a great case study of a business looking to advance technologies and to get more out of a, a, of a footprint, really. Now, the, we're not going to be, there's, there's nothing critical to say about these machines at all. You know, the Haas machines are reliable, good workhorses. But what this story really is about is about you being able to keep the spindle running, isn't it? It's automation. Exactly, yeah. I mean, it's going to be our first first machine where we can we can maintain the spindle uptime throughout the entire shift by obviously loading during the cycle so that spindle doesn't stop. Um, and then also, being twin pallet, we should be experiencing some uh, good unmanned hours, possibly four or five hours every single night unmanned, um, which obviously at the moment we're not getting. Do you think that this is critical for you as a business to go down this line? Do you think you would risk maybe losing customers in the future if you couldn't satisfy their demands of increased, uh, increased component manufacture? Yeah, definitely. It's something we've thought about for quite a long time. Um, and obviously the Averex machine is a very, very high spec machine in its own right. And additionally, we can in the future expand the machine to, uh, to more pallets and more tools, which basically gives us even more options and more flexibility going into the future. That was going to be my next point. Supplied oh. by White House Machine Tools in the UK here, you selected Averex not not just solely because you've got a good relationship with them, was it? It was to do with the, the spec of the machine, the modularity of it. As you've said, you can add a tool chain or you can add tools to it, increase the tool capacity and increase the pallet capacity, all within quite a tight footprint. Does that reassure you that you can go wherever the business takes you with that machine? Yeah, definitely. It's, it's a future-proofing investment by, by the fact that it's expandable. It, it can expand as we grow um, to suit our needs in the future. It, and, and obviously the machine itself is very, very high spec, hand built machine, um, top quality components, um, and, and, and obviously the service and support from White House, it was, um, it was a, you know, we felt confident making that decision.